two years ago, I didn't know what I wanted to be when I was older. So I took SoCal just to study what I wanted to do. And now I, uh, I'm so passionate about game design that I'm going to Santa Cruz to study game design. The governor's budget uh, eliminated the line item for uh, career technical education programs like SCROC. So uh, I've introduced AB 1214 uh, to fight for SCROC and to save SCROC. SCROC is the crown jewel of Kura Technical Education. Uh, it was founded in 1967. It's been educating over 10,000 kids as well as uh, young adults uh, every year. Kids that may or may not uh, be thinking about going to uh, four-year colleges but still need to have the vocational skills necessary to, uh, to find jobs in today's market. The same things that make it interesting for me as a teacher also make it interesting for me as an employer in the aerospace industry. Students here have an opportunity to actually apply the skills that they're learning, get some real world experience with it, and then be able to take and bring that directly into the job environment. Scroc had a program where if you're in high school you can come here for free and you can take the program. It gave me a great start and able to be able to get into the career that I'm in love with. I come here to pursue my dreams to be a mechanic. It's a place that will make you pursue your dreams. It's a good place to be because it taught me the basic on what I want to be. You get the hands-on experience that you would never get in a regular classroom. And you just get experiences with other students from other schools. And it's great. I love it. <laughs> Going to college and getting an, a great education and getting that theory is great. But when you find a, a, a place that can actually hands-on train you, and get you ready to walk in and work is very different and it has a different impact. This form of education is career technical education. It is a foundation to continue into a career path, but it also provides them with jobs. As we call it, we easily can say that this is a school to a career to a job. SCROC is also successful because it works with uh, local businesses uh, and talks to them and finds out what are their job needs, what are their uh, workforce needs, and SCROC tailors their programs to meet the workforce needs. We are so happy to partner with them because they make some of the best medical assistants that are part of our staff and some of the other doctors' staffs here in the South Bay. Doctors are always coming to us looking for employees that they can have confidence in, that they are ready to work, ready to go, and that they can become part of the healthcare team. I think that with the community here, it's like a free college program for high school students. So right out of high school, kids can be going in and getting these careers. If we don't prepare the next generation for those jobs, who's going to take the next jobs when they're open? With all the emphasis these days on STEM, it would make absolutely no sense to cut the funding here for SoCal ROC. We feel that SoCal Rock needs to stay open as a center. In order for us to be able to continue to provide those types of experiences to the students, we need our funding. Governor, please fund this program. This is an excellent program that's been around for over 45 years and that we, we the business community, need these people to be trained and be prepared for work. I'm asking for your help to save SCROC. Uh, I'm asking you to uh, not only write a letter to support my bill, a AB 1214, but also to send a message to the governor that career technical education is really important uh, for our kids, for our young adults, uh, for the future of the state of California. Make sure that uh, we have a strong career technical education program to educate our future workforce.